Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name's Jerick and welcome back to Feed the Beast Unleashed. Now one thing you may notice straight off, everything looks a bit different. Yep, yeah, that's because I'm using Sfax now. Uh, it's a texture pack, I'll link to it in the description. Um, it, I was asked to use it by someone in the comments and me. I, ooh, the clouds look a bit funny to be honest. Uh, <laughs> but... I thought I'd give it a go. I like to try new stuff. To be honest, apart from the clouds, that do look a bit weird. Um, everything does look a lot better, actually. And it looks cartoony, but it looks nice. And they've, they've done a hell of a lot of textures. I mean, it's not... Let's go sleep, shall we? It's not as easy as you might think to set it up. I mean, I've, I had to mess around quite a bit with it, but... That was partially my fault. Uh, yeah. Pro tip for you guys. Uh, in the Feed the Beast options, um, there's a slider for how much RAM that you allow the game to use. Uh, I would set that up quite high. <laughs> Especially if you're planning to use Sfax. <laughs> the RAM needs to load the game, all the mods that go with the game, and all the new textures. So you do need a fair bit. And for some reason, mine was only set to a tiny amount. Anyway. Ah, that doesn't that look beautiful, actually. Look at that. 493 bucket falls. Still going. Still going. That river of lava haven't run out yet. Still going strong. Right. Now. Today. Or oh, last time, I made a very stupid mistake. Now, you may have noticed last time that this built, but then nothing happened. It's a bit strange, isn't it? Well, that's because I'm an idiot. Uh, a quarry needs one megajoule of power Oop. to work. Let's flick these back. And uh, these only provide, well, when you stick lava in them, they only provide half a megajoule of power. So, we're going to have to use different engines. Now, that's not too bad. I, I plan to use magmatic engines anyway, which is what we're going to switch to. Now, magmatic engines use Invar, I think, which you can't mine, but you can create using pulverized ferrous metal and pulverized iron. I don't actually need a crafting bench, but there you go. There you go, Invar Blend. That should be enough to do us, actually. Bung that back in there. Let's get this cooking. Uh, hmm. Might need some coal for that. Right. Get that cooking. Huh. That looks pretty. Anyway. Yeah, one also thing, one other thing with Sfax, uh, you might want to check your field of view slider. Mine was all the way to that bit and looks really zoomed in. I'm not even sure if I've got it right now, but it looks better now. Looks better. I've got a big monitor, so yeah. I don't know why that changed that. It might have been because it crashed a few times because I messed up a bit, but there you go. Fine. Right, let's have a look at that while that invar's going. Sorry, my phone went off, but back to the game and the river of lava. Ooh. Oh, it is drying up a bit. Hurry, it'll go down. Oh, look. There's tons of stuff down there. Hurry, it'll, it'll go down there. Oh, there's absolutely tons of stuff down there. Yeah. Maybe later I'll make my way down. This looks a bit solid. Make some steps there or something going down. But there's still lava there. After 500 bucket falls. We've still got more. That's going to power us for some time. Not to mention, I'm sure there's lava everywhere else we can nick. 
All right, come on. Diddy, 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 diddy. Right, so we need some magmatic engines. Let's power our quarry. Now it's only a start of our power. I want to build a power plant, a proper one. It then feeds into some redstone boxy things. There we go, that should be enough for a couple at least. Right, let's get some iron. Got some wood. Got some stone. Redstone. That's the other thing. Redstone. Yeah, one of the things about Sfax, I'm going to have to learn what all this stuff actually is. I'm getting there. It's not too hard. Not too hard to figure out. Right, we need three of those. Um, not four. Two, three. One, two, one, two, three, three. Bang, bang, bang. Right. Three pistons. Uh, we need loads of cogs. We want three engines, so that's six cogs. Oh, just enough in bar for that. That's cogs, engines. Um. Ah, redstone transmission coil. We need silver, bugger. Uh, silver, silver. Why is that separate? Oh, right, that's a different one. Um, oh. One, two, three. We only need three. Um. Let's use the other oven thing. What do you call it? Run, jump. Right. Here it is. Oh, we've been baking bread. <laughs> we've got absolutely tons of bread. Uh, three of those. Right. Don't need all that bread with us. Plenty of supplies. This small patch here seems to do me all right. I was going to make a. Uh, I might still make a, a proper multi-farm thing, just so I can uh, don't have to keep collecting it, but might automate it, have it pumping into a, oh no, it's got to turn into flour. Uh, oh well, could try something. Right, we got that. Right, we should have everything we need to make our magmatic engines. And we have buckets, we have buckets, yep. Right. Silver, one, two, three, one, two, three. Three you. Get some more of this. Oh, that's plenty. Where's the gears? Uh, you there. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Magmatic engine, there we go, right. Plonk these down. Uh, let's fill up our buckets first, actually, so we don't have to run back and forwards. And. Oh! I just click on them with the bucket. I didn't realise that. I was expecting the menu to open so I could put the buckets inside. If I just click on it with a bucket, I won't really get it. Right. You there, you there, and you there. Um, oh, I can't remember this. Oh, bugger. Once they change these, MJ using a lot of lava will break if energy cannot be transferred. Wrench to repair. Redstone control tab. Configures how this device reacts to redstone signals. Well, I just want to stick lava in it, mate. Or do I have to pump it in it? Well, oh, fuck, I don't tell me I have to pump it in it. That's what I wanted to avoid. Oh. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. <sighs> 
Now I made another stupid mistake. Don't worry, I still need magmatic engines. They're what I'm using for my power station. And I will have pipes pumping to it. There. But I was hoping I could just shove some lava in there. One, two, three. Those. No cobblestone. We got wood, we got wood. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right, now we're just going to have to make some box standard down. Uh, Sterling engines. There we go. Got there in the end. Uh, that's just enough, that should be. Um, iron. One, two, three. One, two, three. Should be just enough. One, two, three. One, two, three. Right. Pistons. Gears, glass, one, two, three, and you. Sterling engines, right. Oh, bugger, it's dark. Right. Now, I'll go to sleep, see you in a bit. Morning, right. Now, we will get this to work eventually. I'm not sure which way they flicked. Uh, sterling engines. Bang, bang, bang. Back. Lava. Is that on? Is that off? That's off. It's on. Bloody hell. I haven't just wasted that bucket of lava, have I? No, it's still going. Right, that I can just stick a bucket of lava in. And look, it's going! Popping out the top there. Oh, I should have made that a golden pipe, shouldn't I? No. Yeah. Oh well, it's dreadfully slow right now. It's probably going to take more lava than it should. But it's working. That's the important thing. It's working. Right. Let's just put a second bucket in them so it doesn't run out anytime soon. Right, enough distractions. Stick an extra bucket of lava. Keeps it going for a bit longer. Sorted. Oh, we got one layer off. And a hell of a lot of dirt. <sighs> I was hoping that magmatic engine would work. Oh, well. Right. Now, what we're going to need for this power plant. We really want a place to put all these machines actually. Let's build no, let's build the what we want is the magma oh it needs never brick. Shit. Uh uh, uh mm, oh dear. Right, okay. Means we need never brick. Yeah, it's no easy way about it. Uh, we're going to have to go to the nether, which means I'm going to have to get some thingamabobs, whatchamacallits, um, with the old uh, thingamajigs. I'll get there eventually. Um, with the obsidian, we've got there. Right, obsidian. We're going to have to get some obsidian. Let's get rid of these and these and these, these, these. Well, it doesn't go in there. Gems. Well, there is one place that's obsidian. We've already seen it, right? Uh, we've got plenty of pickaxe, torches, torches. We've got no wood. Have we got any coal? We've got coal, no wood. Right, the one place I'm thinking of is the river of lava. There's water on top, and it made some obsidian. Oh, I haven't got hacks anymore. It's all going to pot. Come on. Always take wood, will you? 
you always need more torches. You can make hundreds and hundreds and hundreds. You always need wood. Right. And of course you can get coal down there. Right, where's the sun? Yeah, it's alright. Good time of day. This looks full. 679. <laughs> right. Yes, let's go down to our river of lava. Said I'd do it later, and well, now's as good a time as any. Yes, we need the magma crucible and a liquid transposer. Get rid of that rubbish. Um, so we can uh, make make the oh baby Enderman. Oh oh Christ! Um, don't look at it. Uh, <laughs> Disturbing little freak. Um, so we can make. Um, I'll get there eventually. Molten redstone. With molten redstone, we can. Ooh. I've actually got torches, have I? I've got some wood, but I've made them into torches. Yes, with molten redstone we can make redstone conduit, which is like a, a very good wire. And we can make um, a redstone box thing. Oh, bugger, there's a weird purple zombie down there. Why the hell is he purple? Okay, that's weird. Um, yeah, hmm, um, let's go this way. Uh, I really lose track of my thought very quickly. Yeah, redstone box thing. I can't remember what it's called. It's like a giant battery. It stores energy made from engines like the magmatic engine. Oh, sugar monkeys. So we can store all the energy we make in the magmatic engines. We'll have a battery of about, I don't know, about 10 of them. 10, 3, 3, about 30 maybe actually, about 30 engines, oh sugar, this doesn't look like a very nice place, is that diamond, it's a hell of a lot of diamond, okay now, nah. right, yes more, more torches, definitely more torches, Blobs. Hey, blobs. Uh, and where was I? There we go. Right, there's a way up. What's with this? Oh, aluminium mulberry. Tons and tons of stuff. Aha! This will be an easier one to get. Um, have I got super absorbent blocks for that water? Yes, I have super absorbent pads. Right. Is there lava? No. Right. It's going to take a while. Yeah, and with the redstone engine, we can make a. Uh, um, redstone engine, redstone battery. We can store all the energy from the thirty magmatic engines, and uh, and use it as we need it. Hopefully, with some tesseracts, which is another reason we we need some molten ender, which sadly we have to get out of ender eyes. But there is an easy way to get those using a. Minium stone. Christ, I'm well off the ball. Right, anyway. I think I'll end it here. We've got some obsidian. And next episode, we'll be going to the nether. Get some nether bricks. So we can make some magma crucibles. 
also see what else we can get. See if we're near an ender fortress. Because they're always handy. Chock full of stuff. They are in a new version of vanilla Minecraft anyway. I don't know if they are. I think they're probably not. But in the newest version of vanilla Minecraft there's boxes of all sorts of guff there. They didn't used to be, mind you. But anyway, that's for another day. We'll see that later. I don't know if we'll be even close to one. Usually my luck we're not, but there we go. We'll see. Right. Bye-bye, people.